Time to strut your stuff! You can't yes. do it! So what? We just hang around here till he shows up? Big guy with a gun for an arm? Word is he lives in this town. Just shut up and wait. We'll find him soon enough. Man! Seems like the boss always gives us the most shit-tastic assignments. Guess that's why we're paid so damn much. <laughs> Hey, brother. You from around the way? I guess. No big man with a big gun strapped to his right arm? Pretty set up shop somewhere in the neighborhood. That depends. Ah. <laughs> Clever. Smell an opportunity to make some scratch to you. 500. 200. Mm, three. Whatever, man. Let's find somewhere quiet to talk. Walk with me. Something to what? say? Ah! You looking at me? Is he with them? Hmm? Hey. Move it! I I'm said so move! Sorry. Look at all these assholes staring at us. This shithole's got nothing on Walmart. Am I right? Word of advice, Blondie. Don't piss off my friend here. You'll be real sorry. Unless you got some kind of death wish, then be my guest. <laughs> After you, brother. And don't worry, I ain't the backstabbing type. Most days. You know where the bastard's hiding, don't you? I told you before. That depends. Oh yeah? You wasted my time! Shinra's time, you mean? <laughs> Shinra knows better than to stick its nose in my boss's business. Like I give a shit. No holding back.
Spill it. Shenra, then... Not my problem. Lesson one for life on the ground floor. Get some rest. for me to hang around here. Everyone's you rarely see. Don't take your eyes off. Who were those people anyway? You rarely see guys like that even here. Way the guys from 6. No rush it and drop your tools. Take your time now, okay? Huh? So he's the rat slayer. You ever take a stroll down Colbert Street? Of course not. Full of thugs and creeps, isn't it? Nah, just some sketchy stores. Not the least bit curious? Um, I don't know if that's my thing. I've seen them around here a few times before. Something went down. The finale's a touch different, but if you see it for yourself, you'll understand. If I can get a ticket, that is. Pretty sure those freaks have been Some here before. Some creepy dude who hit on me was asking all kinds of strange questions about Seventh Heaven, about Barrett and the other members of his crew. You talking about the creepy dude out of Wall Market? You know him? Girl, your eyes are more dazzling than the neon lights of the Honeybee Inn. He gave you that line too, huh? Oh hey, 
Hey, thanks for helping out a fellow entrepreneur. Probably so crowded because everyone else is stuck down here. Chili beans! Get your chili beans! A Sector 7 favorite! How about it? Y'all won't find better beans this side of the plate! Blame it on the bomb! Ain't your fault! Just all across the way does. Hmm. Platy, am I right? Huh? A local boy would know what a stall's selling just by the look of it. That's all. To thin the buttress. Wife's probably gonna give me stitch. Blame it on the bomb! Ain't your fault! Just imagine if rich people start thinking it's safer down here than on the plate. Enough of them move down here. Life's bound to change for the better, no? Keep dreaming, buddy. My husband decided to go to the station and see if it had gotten any better. The bombings made such a mess of everything. So they blew up a reactor so they could save the planet? More like they want us to give up our way of life. There will be no way of life for anyone if we kill the planet. So the environmentalists say. But I say people and their jobs and their families have to come first. Otherwise, what's the point? Your sweet time. Uh, uh, <sighs> Psych. <sighs> Are you gonna let me in so we can talk in private? Guess I'll get right to the point then. What have you got there? An apology for not getting you on the mission. Uh. Or not. What do you think it is? A proposition. Nailed it in one. Gonna have to ask you to keep all this a secret from the others, though. It's a personal matter. Something I need to sort out tonight. Tonight? Tonight. You and me, together. I want you to come with me to the Sector 7 plate. I'll give you the details on the way. That's fine by me, but don't you have a pretty big day ahead of you? I do, but if I don't deal with this now, it's only gonna get harder. Anyway, I can count on you, can't I? Hmm. Oh. A down payment. Doubt we'll be back before morning, in case you were planning on traveling light. Make sure you've got everything you need before we leave. I'll wait here. set awesome meet me at the station after dark don't be late <laughs> it's just another job Tough break. They changed the times. The last train's already left. Which is why we borrowed these bikes. Need a lift to the plate? How did you guess? Easy. You've been acting weird. Bike talking about one thing when you're obviously thinking about something else. 
Yeah, and don't get me started on all that pep. All right, I'll give you that. But how did you know I wanted to head topside? Was I talking in my sleep? What else did I say? No, we just figured you wanted to see your parents, that's all. Nailed it, huh? Yep, right on the head. So, seeing as we don't have any family of our own, how about you let us be a part of yours for a bit? You know, spread the wealth. Hmm. Are your parents still around? Huh? Uh, no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay then, guess you're all invited. Here's to awkward family reunions! Yeah! <laughs> I take it you boys have your brand spanking new IDs? Yes, ma'am. Then let's lay down some rubber. Drink that rubber. Okay, you got it. You hear me? Yeah. Just so you know, I'm not going plate side for the reason they think I am. Look, you saw the way the reactor went up. It was huge, right? Because of all the Mako. Isn't that what you said? Yeah. That was wishful thinking. Deep down, I know it was my fault. I used a more powerful blasting agent than the directions called for. It had nothing to do with the Mako. Let's say you're right. So what? I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. But, since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Shinra? Good luck with that. With your help, we won't need luck. Uh, 
saying he's less than a few minutes out. Copy. Think it's him? Huh? More reason to finish this quick. That kind of trouble. Me 
to recharge. Take care of your bike. Same shit, me and a dumbass. Not bad! You have promise and an abiding affection for your mount. But one cannot simply ride one's bike. Yeah. <laughs> Need to recharge? Nay, one must unlock its true potential. Become one with the machine. Like this! Yeah. <laughs> A fiery gift for you! Oh, 
explosives! There is a point to the world! This must work me faster by the second! Two! As if I could ever grow tired of your company. Naughty, naughty! Until one of our flames is forever extinguished, the flames will never rest! <laughs> Fight for me! Room! <laughs> oh, oh, oh! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's push it past the red line! Jesse, take over. Huh? <laughs> 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 time we can keep it just between the two of us. Maybe. <laughs> Until we meet again, my friend! We did it! Go team! Don't get too excited. Reinforcements are hot on our trail. You failed the test. What test? Driving. I'm great at driving. <laughs> great at scaring your passengers, more like. Not used to having any. Maybe you should just let me drive. Nope. <laughs> Guess I'll take one for the team and be your back warmer again. Would you look at that? It's the end of the ride. <sighs> we'll go on foot from here. Don't want to draw too much attention to ourselves. Hey, did these things leave a mark? <laughs> they got you pretty good. Oh, and I'm running on fumes. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll top you up soon enough. Now let's roll. residential areas just beyond this gate. Mind doing the honors? <sighs> district where they put you when your parents work for Shinra all their reactors were slowly killing the planet we were living the good life Thank you. 
Folks here must be living off three or four times what I do. screwing around. Figures. Still leaves the lights on every night. For the girl who only comes home once every other blue moon. Mom's an old-fashioned type like that. Think she'll make us pizza? Her Midgar special? She's quite the cook, quick to whip up finger-licking food even if you drop by in the dead of night. And she loves guests who ask for seconds or thirds. Gotta move. Okay, let's head in. Cloud, you know what to do. Why don't you wait around the corner over there? Uh, okay. It's a shame you won't get to try the Midgar special. You would have really liked it. With your help, we won't need luck. You'll take on just about any job, right? Well, I need you to rob my house. Think you can do that for me? Huh. Go in through the back door when the coast is clear. The signal will be obvious. Once the lights come on, it's go time. Time to go. You'll find a room with two doors. Don't take the one in front of you. You want the room on the right. That's where you'll find it. Sorry about dropping in like this again. This will always be your home. So, how's practice going? <laughs> going you get so fixated lose sight of things that's why i'm glad you've got a rock like this always there taking up space hey <laughs> raised on praise i see so that's where she gets it from the legendary midbar special fantastic as always mrs r i always keep enough ingredients on hand to make extra just for you Yeah, 
We'll be chatting mom up in the kitchen, so don't even bother being quiet. There's no way she'll ever hear you. Dad'll be in there, but it's okay. I need you to grab his Shinra ID card. And yeah, I know I should do it myself, but... <laughs> but I honestly don't think I'm up to it. Just do this for me, okay? Alright, here comes a Midgar special! No, not here. This isn't it. Jesse. What's this? Dear Mom and Dad, Sorry for not getting in touch sooner, but... I'm working at the Gold Saucer as an actress now. It wasn't easy, and I had a lot of help from people along the way. But I managed to land a starring role. And closed our two tickets to my play. Looking forward to seeing you both there. Jesse Raspberry as... the princess? My dad. He was a maintenance supervisor at the reactor. Thanks. accomplished. When are you going to give up on the gold saucer? How long has it been since you even performed? Uh... A lot of people really rely on Jesse. As a stagehand though, right? You can be one of those anywhere. So why not come home and get a job at the Sector 8 Theater? Uh, I'll think about it. You know, I'd really love to stay and chat, but we gotta go. So soon? Yeah, well, we hadn't even planned on dropping by, but Wedge wanted some of your famous mm. pizza. So good. Sure I can't tempt you with some more? Maybe just a couple slices, Mrs. Zarn. Wedge! Hey, I'm, I'm doing it for you guys. You don't want me going to work on an empty stomach. I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. Since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Hey there. This it? Now comes the hard part. I'm gonna use this to sneak into the 7 6 annex. Uh, Alright, let's get to it. Sorry, but you're staying outside. 
Only I know what to steal from where, so it's gotta be me who goes in. So, we came all this way just to eat pizza? <laughs> you think I'd let you off that easy? You're gonna earn every slice helping Cloud. Just do the thing where you draw everyone's attention away, like you did at my parents. What's the word again? Maybe I'm more nervous than I thought. Diversion. Yeah, that. Nice one, military man. So what? Does this mean we're gonna ask some Shinra folks out to dinner? Uh, you know damn well <laughs> what she means. <clears throat> While you're inside, we make sure the guards are focused on the outside, yeah? Exactly. Couldn't have put it any better. When you see a flare go up, that's your cue. Rush the front gates and make for the warehouse plaza. The more hell you raise, the more time you buy me. Huh. You're gonna run this guy into the ground, aren't you? How much time do you think you'll need? Not too much. I'll be in and out. I'll send up another flare when I'm done. We rendezvous in the vacant lot up ahead. Hold on. How are we supposed to get back to the slums? Wait for the first train? No. I want to be back before that. Don't worry. I have something worked out. Now, let's get this done. <sighs> well, that diversion's not gonna create itself. Jesse's dad was in there, right? Yeah. Mako poisoning. <sighs> Happened while Jesse was doing a show with the gold saucer. Ah. But what do you care? No. I want to hear it. Jesse always wanted to be an actress. Worked her ass off for years. Until finally she caught a break. Top billing. Parents were thrilled. And then, right before opening night, her dad had an accident collapsed from overwork. And in the worst possible place, Mako storage. Lay there half a day before someone found him. Been like that ever since. No change whatsoever. And that's what got her into planetology. And led her to seek out Avalanche. How far we've come. Jesse's got a theory about it. Thinks her dad's spirit is stuck now. Between his body and the heart of the planet. So if we don't shut down the reactors soon, He'll get caught up in the flow and poof. <laughs> What's so funny? Just that I understand how you feel. Unlike most of the time. I see. Mako's the essence of life itself. Of memory and hope. It's not something you burn in a reactor just to keep the lights on. Hell no. Oh, uh, don't tell Jessie about this little chat, okay? When she gets pissed, ooh, she gets punchy. Well, no promises. He's serious, Cloud. She'll beat the shit out of us. Not my problem. This guy. Hey, it's the lot Jessie was talking about. We run into here when we've got what we came for. Gotta stay hidden. Wait for the signal. It's so quiet. Just need to get past this gate. Wait. Where are the guards? Jesse! This had better not get in the way of our plans. It won't. Huh. Don't see anyone. What the hell happened? Hey man, the plaza's that way. Warehouses are further in. Jesse's supposed to be circling around from the back, right? For us to rush. Let's scout it out first. I can handle this solo. What? You're trying to keep us out of it now? Don't be a jackass. We're in this together. Don't expect me to save you. If you need to check your gear, now's the time. Give the word when you're good to go. 
You can use that vending machine over there to stock up. Guess there's a training center too. Could go a few rounds before the main event. Man, I get really hungry when I'm nervous. something at home or just need a bite to eat, vending machines can be real lifesavers. Where are you going, Cloud? This way! <laughs> 